our history is woven into the history of the country. So many of our products, either directly or indirectly, have been put into some of the most iconic buildings the country's ever built. We provide careers for just over 500 people around the country, and in 2019, very proudly, we turned 60 years old. People look at us and our business and think it's an eclectic mix, but if you understand our history and understand how we developed, then you get some idea of why. In 1959, Tom Stoddart, Bill's dad, our grandfather, at the age of 47, decided to start a business. A metal worker by trade and with a background in manufacturing electric hot water systems, he founded the company making these products under the Ready Heat brand in a small factory in Cooparoo in Brisbane. Tom was successful at getting established and through the 1960s, he started to look for the next challenge. What could he try next? Turning to his brother, he said, hey Alf, do you like beer? A lot of people seem to like beer. I don't know how to brew it, but maybe we can make some products that hang off it. And with that, the Ready Clean brand was born. In 1971, sadly, Tom passed away and the company lost its founder. Responsibility for the business fell to Tom's brother Albert and his son Bill. Throughout the 70s, the company began supplying and installing commercial kitchens, bars and other products into Queensland's hospitals, pubs and hotels. Still in the 1980s, Paul Hogan put a shrimp on the barbie and he started to fire up Australia's tourism industry. Resorts, casinos and hotels followed and Stoddart rode the wave. 1988 saw World Expo in Brisbane and the bicentennial celebration of a nation. More opportunity and success for Stoddart kitchens, plumbing and architectural metalwork. On to the start of the 90s and it was the hangover after the party. It was Paul Keating's recession that we all had to have. The company began to diversify to manage that risk. In order to increase utilisation of our cutting and bending machines, we began making components under contract for many of Australia's commercial building companies and, and residential building companies. We won a further contract making bus shelters for AdShell, which was Australia's largest outdoor advertising company. 30 years later, these customers continue with us to this day. In the late 90s, with the US dollar exchange rate in the 50s and 60s, we turned our attention to exporting metal store fixtures, manufacturing shelving and display products for federated department stores in the US, and also Virgin Video stores worldwide. The Sydney Olympics in 2000 brought many new opportunities for stadiums and infrastructure. At the time, we competed hard with Curtin Queensland on most jobs on the, on the Eastern Seaboard. They won the Olympic Stadium, we won Docklands in Melbourne. Curtin went into administration in 2002. That was just as we were competing on the next big job, which was Lang, Car Lang Park or Suncorp Stadium in Brisbane. Due to our diversity, we were in pretty good shape at that stage. 
and Bill took his chance to buy Curtin out of administration. We took on 82 new employees and a, a brand new factory, which was conveniently located 400 metres up the road from our existing one. We won the Lang Park job and we kept all three of our factories full in the process. In that same year, 2002, Stoddart bought the 50-year-old Woodson brand from the Wood family and with that our food service equipment business got off the ground with a portfolio of Woodson, Simply Stainless and Coltec. Culinary was created and developed over the following years as was a dedicated kitchen ventilation business that became Halton. More imported brands were added to the mix, Electrolux in 2007, Cooktech, Annette's, Metro and Adande followed suit soon after. We learnt that we could not be everywhere and if we were going to grow into a national business, we needed a distribution network. This brings us to our current state. Food service equipment, kitchen contracting, kitchen ventilation, plumbing products, architectural metalwork, outdoor infrastructure and street furniture, and contract fabrication. All backed by a customer service business, providing support to our products in the field. First of all, I want to thank all of our staff for the contribution that they make to our business. Without them, we are nothing. We want to thank all of our stakeholders, especially those that are here with us tonight. Our suppliers, our customers, and the designers and consultants that put our gear in to projects. Your support means a lot to us, and we could never have achieved what we have without it. So thank you. I hope we can all continue to write the next chapter and the next 60 years together. Lastly, there's one individual in particular who we wanted to recognise here tonight. And for that, I'm going to hand over to my brother, Tim. This award is in, is in uh, recognition for Bill looking after the, the place since 1971. Uh, I want to make it clear that it's not to celebrate uh, his retirement. Uh, that's not what it, this is about. It's uh, to celebrate uh, 60 years of being in business. I thought about how to describe Dad's uh, leadership um, of the business for such a long time. I thought, if you like, and start out to being an oil tanker, and uh, he's the captain, right? Since uh, then, since 1971, you, ne you did nearly always find him at the helm. If he wasn't at the helm, then he was uh, somewhere on the bridge, and if he uh, wasn't on the bridge, he was in the crow's nest looking out for icebergs and sandbanks. We deliberated long and hard about what to get Dad, some sort of memory or a plug. But it's a, a stainless steel platter engraved on the back, Dad, and we couldn't think of anything that was more appropriate. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a special uh, opportunity to talk to you all. We, we've got a lot of stories to tell, and uh, I'm proud to have third generation family members here tonight telling the story. It's been a wonderful function. I'm not sure who's paying the bill, but I guess <laughs> someone will sign the cheque. Thanks for all coming tonight. Please continue to enjoy. Thank you.